Hi guys! Today we're reviewing the CBBS magazine and this is issue 473 and it runs from now until the 24th of January and this month we've got a free fishing play set. Do you like fishing sets? Do you? I know yes. you do. I know you do. So you get three fishes with this and the net. So that's cool. So let's take this free gift off the front. Oh. There's always something to play with when you buy these magazines. Oh, that's come up really easily. There you go. Bye. Okay, so let's have a look. Now, when you buy the CBeebies magazine, it's really good if you like what's lots of Bing doing. Bing. Oh, there's Bing. See, it's good if you like lots of different characters. If you're not, if you don't like one character the most, because you've got uh, Mr. Tumble, you've got Trifu Tom, you've got the Gojetters, you have Andy and um, Sarah and Duck. So, if you like a mixture of characters, and then Alpha Blocks. Alpha Blocks, and this is the one to get. Okay, if you like the mixture of characters. Okay. Have a look. Do you want to open the fishing set for me? Uh, yeah? Let's do that then. So, as usual, you get the sticker page. I can open this up actually for you to see. Things with these magazines, you always get a free gift and you always get a sticker page. So it's quite it's quite nice, really. You always have lots of things to do. And you've got reward chart stickers, you've got stickers here of the presenters of CBBs, and you've got some wonderful stickers. It's really cute. What cartoon is this? Hmm. Do you know? I can't remember what it's called, but we'll find that as we go. Okay. Nelly and Nora. Nelly and Nora, thank you. Okay, then we've got Andy's baby animals. So this is really cute. Look, I'm a baby seal and my big eyes. Can you show everybody the fishes? Okay, all oh, the fishes. All right. Ooh. Our our free gift has been opened. So let me show you. This is the net that you get. You can use this as a cookie bath toy. Put the fishes in here. Do you want to chuck those fishes in here? Okay. Yeah? All right. So what is this? This is a little green, like a green puffer fish that you get. Puffer fish. There you go. And then you've got, what is this? A little orange fish. Like this? Yeah. And then what's this last fish that you get in the fishing place set? A yellow one. Like an angel fish. Angel fish. It's a yellow fish. It's cool, right? Whee, that's good, isn't it? You can add that to your bath toys if you like. You like them? Oh, it's good, isn't it? Then you have a gold Jetsus colouring page oh. and a cut-out moustache. Always oh, good to have a cut-out good disguise. And we've got Pingu. Do you like Pingu? Yeah. Story What's Pingu doing? Uh, catching a big fish. Let's see. He's thinking about fish. He eats fishes, you see. Oh, this is a cool one. Look, this is a sticker page, but it's also a maze. Is that what they call it? A maze. <laughs> My mind. Okay, do you want to do this maze? Come on, here's a pen. Can you lead Pingu all the way, all the way down to home? Can you show me how to do it? Pingu's getting all the way back to home. So you've got to start at the beginning, yeah. Nice job. Ready, set. Can you do it? Looks really good. Here it if we get there, we will get stuck. Uh-huh. Now the thing about these magazines, if parents Amazing. are watching, they usually have lots of good activities for kids. Can I like this? Oh, yeah, sure. There's usually lots of interesting things for kids to do and also learning. Good job. Okay, let's see what's next. This is usually a preschool age magazine. Octonauts. Meet some amazing manatees and help the crew write their creature report. Count the manatees and write your answer. So this is for preschool children and they may not necessarily know how to count. It may do, may not, you know? And then there's a bit of a guide there. So even younger children can give this a go. And then we've got what color are the manatees? Hey, what color are the manatees? Do you know? What color are they? Are they gray or green? They're gray. Oh, great! This is an Everything's Rosy colouring page. And then we've got Timmy Time! Timmy Time! You like Timmy Time? Where's Timmy Time? There it is, and it's a counting page. Timmy looks a lot like Sean the Sheep. He's like Sean the Sheep. Hey, look at this! Draw a picture for Bing. Do you want to draw a picture for Bing? What would you Yay. draw? What would you draw? A dinosaur picture. As well? Go on then, draw us a dinosaur. Don't you have to dinosaur? help me do. <laughs> I don't, okay, I'll help you, but I have to say I'm not, I'm not that much of an artist. 
but I will give it a go, okay? Let me think. Um, oh my gosh. Okay. okay. I'm just copying now. Make it in the picture. Like this? Wow. <laughs> I'm so glad that you like my drawings. Someone has to. Uh, okay. Yeah, okay. Some, oh my goodness. I'm not. Wow. You know what? It doesn't matter if you're not that good at drawing. You should just draw anyway. Drawing. drawing is relaxing. Drawing is. Relaxing. Drawing is relaxing. And it's fun to see the spikes. Most important thing for dinosaurs are spikes, right? Ah. No, it has a zigzag. Huh? What else do you want to add to the a dinosaur? A zigzag. Go on then. Oh, very nice. Oh, we've got really big eyes. Now, what's a nice dinosaur? What's the Can dinosaur Can you help me do the zigzaggy? What zigzaggy bits? Where? Mm, Here, two lines. Like Bing. Line, like Not this. too live, just like Bing. Oh, uh, I don't know. What else do we need to do? Have some dots, yeah? Dots and lines. There you go. That's good. Yeah. I think that looks pretty good. Yay, Oz. Tree 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 Tom game. Yeah. And you even have this to make a dice if you don't have any dice at home. No, she do this. It's a game, my darling. We have to do this. Let's do it some next time. do this game. Okay, we'll come back to it. We'll come back to it. Okay. Get well soon. Coloring page. What coloring page is in this month? And Nelly and Nora Sunshine. Draw and colour matching half. So you need some uh, crayons for this. Crayons or drawing pencils or felt tips will Look. do. I can draw this. But you don't we don't have a yellow pen. Pen! We don't have a yellow one on earth. We can get one though. Rainbow. What makes a rainbow? We've got sun and rain. Oh, this is a nice more colouring. This is definitely for younger children. Snow. Find out about snow. Oh wow. Where's the snow? You want to draw the snowman? Snowman. You have to trace the lines. You have to help me do. Oh, wait, 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 let's do this. Oh, now this, I don't know this one because I don't... Do you like this? Okay. How many raincoats are there? What's up? Let me see what page one, this. Two, three, this three, four, five, eight, nine, two. I can't... Oh, there it is. <sighs> okay, let's have a look. Page... What sticker page is this? Oh, okay. And you have to stick raincoat on for Nellie and Nora. Whose raincoat is that? I think it's these guys. They have matching raincoats and matching dresses. What's the raincoat? It's to stop the rain from getting you wet. What's that? It just goes on top. What's that like for? So it goes on top like this. Yeah, because it's like a coat. Can you do it? Yeah. Good. Lovely. And now we have to write this. How many raincoats are there? Mm, two. Okay, write number two then. What's that? I'm going to show you in a second. Write this. Write number two. Two. Because there's two raincoats, yeah? Perfect. And now, i got two umbrellas here. Where should I stick these umbrellas? Oh. I think they go here. Oh. Oh my gosh, there's still so many pages wow, to go. Alright, you done? Wow, wow, wow. Yeah! Okay, good. Right. Huh? We're running out of memory. We have to be quick now because I'm running out of space. Mummy's running out of space. Okay, do you want to do this one? What you like doing these tracing lines is good again for children that are learning to write and draw. And then we've got this something special. Tick the clothes that help you stay warm. So it's hats, gloves and scarf. How about flip flops? What do you guys think? And then 
We've got the bedtime hour, and this time it's a Sarah and Duck story, which is really nice to read at bedtime with your mum and dad or your guardian. And then we've got Sarah and Duck. Oh, I love Sarah and Duck. It's one of my favourite. I think it's a really, really <coughs> lovely looking cartoon. And then finally, it's got what well, we've got next week is the post office set. Where's the do you want to do this one? Do you want to do these? I know you really enjoy these twisty ones. Do you want to do this? Just these. Just these. No? Do you want to do them? I think it's overwhelming because it's so I have to do them. Go on then. Come on, quickly. What can I do? There's loads to do. What does he do? I think I can barely stand up. Can you do it? Follow the lines. my little friend here is only just turned four years old so just to give you any parent um, an idea of what level the magazine nine. is for but it totally depends because you know some kids can read some kids can't at this age are you okay let's have a look good job okay we're going to carry on with this magazine because there's just so many things to do in it did did go ahead oh my Oh, can you do it? You're going from the other way. So yeah, we're going to carry on with this. And so we hope you enjoyed this review, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.